Gaffer, your thoughts on the performance? Um, I thought we started OK. Um, I had some good chances um, early in the game. Sending off set us back a bit, especially after conceded a poor goal. Um, still had some good moments. Lost our way a bit towards the first half, I felt. We changed it second half, changed the shape. Um, and I felt we did everything to get back in the game. The keepers pulled off some incredible saves today. And, um, you know, a bit of lack of composure from us as well. But also the keeper has had a very good game. Um, but I felt we did everything we could to try and get back in the game. Um, it wasn't to be. And uh, we need to dust ourselves down now and uh, have a good week in training and get ready for next week against Bradford. So the early red card changed the dimension of the game? Um, I mean, obviously... The, once the other lad got sent off, you know, they set back in and, and made it difficult. Um, and then to get a goal you know, for them was, was an incredible lift. Um, and I think that's what you saw. You saw a team you know, hugely lifted by that. And we just, like I say, just lost our way up to only just five, ten minutes just before our half time. Um, but second half, we were, we were loads better. We played a lot more positively. We, we stepped in with the ball. Um, Got some good crosses in the box, had some great chances. And like I said, the keepers pulled off some incredible saves today and you've got to give them credit for that. I mean, the keeper pulls off so many saves, you just have that feeling it might not be your day. Yeah, I felt on the touchline that if we got one, we'd, we'd go and win the game. Um, but sometimes that happens. And um, you know, I said to the lads that, you know, the Bolton fans will be driving away disappointed. But I'd like to think they've seen the team which has given everything today. Having now lost that unbeaten start, do you perhaps learn more from the players after a defeat? Yeah, throughout the course of the season, you're going to win, draw and lose games. And we've got to respond in all types of ways. And um, we'll regroup on Monday morning and uh, get ready for a, a, a good build-up and a terrific game next Saturday. And fantastic away sport again today. Yeah, the sport's incredible. And uh, you know, I'm just disappointed for them that they're not going home with, with, with a result. Um, but like I said, you know, we ask for everything in terms of the commitment levels from the lads and the drive to get back in the game. And I felt we showed that. Um, it just wasn't to be in terms of putting the ball in between those three white sticks. One positive, the return of Zach Clough. Yeah, um, you know, he's trained well this week, Zach. And ideally it was only going to be a 25-minute role for him. But I just felt against 10 men that he'd be able to do the 45. And, and we'll assess him again during the week and, and have a look at him, see how he trains this week. Uh, but I thought he showed some good touches, had a couple of really good chances um, himself. Um, but, you know, that will come. And your thoughts on uh, Keshi Anderson's dismissal? I mean, it was a fast score decision because I was still on the touchline. The fourth official who uh, did have communication problems all, all afternoon kind of told him to go on. I, I stood next to him and, you know, I heard it in my own ears. And, uh, you know, the officials think Keshi was trying to gain an advantage to make us play with 12 men for five minutes. He wasn't trying that. He was told to go on the pitch and I was shouting, no, get off, because Chris hadn't come off. So just common sense had to prevail there. I mean, that's just, you know, entering the field of play. But he wouldn't have entered the field of play if the fourth official hadn't told him to do. So I'll go and see the ref about that. And I don't think a player's ever been sent off for more to innocuous decisions in, in, in football. And now a big week ahead ahead of a clash with your former employers, Bradford City. Yeah, looking forward to that. And, um, you know, they've kind of uh, had a good result today. And um, But I'm looking forward to the game. And like I say, you need a reaction. Um, a lot of plaudits for the way we start the season. We are having a bit of a sticky spell because we've drawn uh, the games prior to this. But we need to regroup um, and come out strong next week. And we will do.